Hey guys, it's iPhone Elves here, and today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your new 3.1.3 firmware that Apple just released yesterday, I believe. So this this will be with Red Snow, Red Snow 0.9.3 and 0.9.4. So this will work for the iPhone second generation, iPhone third generation, uh, the iPod Touch first generation, and the iPod Touch second generation non C model. This will not work for the iPod Touch second generation with the with non C model, and it won't work with the new iPod Touch third generation. So if you want to know if you, whether you have the non C model or if you have the N C model, just go to your right here. Just go to your settings. Settings general and then all the way in the, uh, click about and then you'll see it all the way in the bottom you'll see right there uh, focus you'll see MB so that says MB so this will work if this is MC it won't work and also you need to be already updated to 3.1.3 firmware so and also you need to have your iTunes uh, Upgraded to the new firm uh, the new version. So go ahead and do those things and then follow this tutorial so once you have that Let's go uh, uh, There'll be a link in the sidebar to my website where you can download the, the Program and the firmware. So here you go ahead and go download the 3.1.2 firmware for your device go here and download it then once you have that if you have the iPhone second generation or the third generation or the iPod Touch first generation you'll need to download one of these so if you have Mac if you, if you have Mac here Windows here and then if you have the iPod Touch second generation non C model which I'll be using so for me I downloaded this for the Windows if you have a Mac just download this so once you have all these save to your desktop I show something like that so the firmware is right here 3.1.2 and red snow 0.9.4 is right here. Go ahead and open that. And now it's gonna say to browse. So make sure you browse for the firmware, this firmware here, 3.1.2. And then click next. And here it'll say it just will say if you have the MC model or if if you do press yes, if you don't press no. And press next. Now here it says to put it in. Uh, no, not here. Sorry. Now what you want to do is uh, make sure this is check mark. Install Cydia. Obviously, you want Cydia. Then if you want a boot logo, boot, uh, boot logo, click here and choose a random picture which today I'm not going to install this so I'm just going to click this and click next now you have to put your iPhone or your iPod in DFU mode so I'll go ahead and show you that go ahead and open this so you'll need to hold the power and the home button for for 10 seconds and then release the power or the home button and keep uh, the power button and keep holding the home button so we'll start off by holding both of them as you can see I'm holding them holding now let go once you hear the noise just let go and keep holding the home button and just let go once you hear the noise again so now your iPod is in DFU mode it should be black don't worry and iTunes should recognize it as recovery mode just click no no and exit that close that and now press next and now it's jailbreaking it as you can see get this to the side so it should be white And now they're rebooting, and iTunes should recognize it. Go ahead and close this. 
and see it says downloading jailbreaking data. Give that a little minute. And if you guys haven't checked my giveaway, my 300 subscriber giveaway, there will be a link in the sidebar and annotation in here. Make sure you go and check that out and make sure you enter. I'm giving away a prom frame and two iPhone iPod case and an iPhone case. Make sure you go check that out. Link in the sidebar. And now it says done. So I'll go ahead and click finish. And now it's gonna uh, it's gonna reboot. Just has a couple of minutes with I the device. As you can see, it's rebooting. See the poem, pineapple. Not pineapple, what am I saying? Anyway. Almost there, installing bundles. And it should be done any minute, any seconds. Rebooting. And there you go. You see the Apple logo. If you have if if you put a custom boo logo, you should see the custom boo logo now. But since I didn't, so I see the normal Apple logo. Give that a second and should be done. There you go. Now iTunes should pop up and now you can uh, put all your stuff back. So as you can see here, uh, let me close that out. So as you can see here, it's jailbreaked with Cydia right here. Cydia is working. So it's jailbreaked and it's still in 3.1.3 .3 firmware. As you can see, let's go to general about and there you go. It's still in 3.1.3 from her. So there you have it, guys. Make sure to rate five star. Leave a uh, make sure to subscribe. And if you have any problems or need any help, please leave a comment, and I'll try to respond to you as soon as possible. And that's all about it, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.